What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Power Play with CJ. Uh, today we're going to talk about the next captain of the Detroit Red Wings, obviously with Lindstrom hanging him up. Um, you know, a lot of good candidates in that locker room. You know, Johan Franzen plays the game hard, plays the game right. Uh, Zetterberg's one of Colin Smythe. But the only logical explanation, in my opinion, logical choice, excuse me, is uh, Pavel Dotsuk. Obviously, one of the elite two-way players the game's ever seen. Uh, Two-time Stanley Cup winner. Uh, won a plethora of Selkie trophies for league's best defensive forward. It is, a, I definitely think, a shiny example of everything the Detroit organization stands for. A late round pick that blossomed in and one of the preeminent players in the game who, you know, plays the game the way it's supposed to be played. You know, he's a shiny example of what Detroit stands for. P kills penalties, plays the defensive side of the puck, can shut down your top line and still average a point a game. And I think, you know, that's a shiny example. I think he's learned from Eisenman and Lidstrom before him, how to lead, and you know, he's a leader now, he wears an A, but it's time to add him to the list of the great Detroit captains over the years, and I put the C on his chest, you know, you look at it, uh, the Red Wings are a lot like, to get sidetracked a little bit, like the San Antonio Spurs or the, the Patriots, you know, you buy into that system, you know, if you're coming into San Antonio, here's what you're going to do, you're going to rebound, you're going to do this, and that's it, same thing with Detroit, you know, Oh, you were a 20 goal scorer somewhere else, that's great. You're going to be in the third line, you're going to grit, you're going to provide us with grit and toughness. If you don't like it, there's the door. Go score your 20 goals for another team and miss the playoffs every year, or come here and compete for the Stanley Cup. And that's. Dotsuk is a perfect example of that. You know, with the next wave of young Detroit players coming up, you know, Brendan Smith, Gustav Nyquist, Riley Sheen, guys like that. It's going to be up to Dotsuk to show them the ropes. And obviously, Zetterberg, Franz, and those guys. I've uh, been around Cronwall that have been around for a while, but you know, a guy like Dotsuk, you know, you guys are all high picks. Dotsuk was, you know, Detroit gave him a look and he ran, he took the ball and ran with it. Um, you know, he he's everything Detroit stands for. I think he's a perfect exam, perfect uh, guy to wear the C. You know, a class act off the ice that'll uh, put the move on you on the ice that'll make sports on you. I just think everything about him's great, and he uh, definitely has earned the right to wear the C. You know, he's leads by example and uh, when you see your best player sacrificing your body to, sacrificing his body to block shots take hits and uh, on top of that score absolute beauty goals and uh, you know deep guys into the 10th row that's how can you not respond and do your part to play as hard as you can you know and that that's like I said everything Detroit stands for as an organization and uh, Pablo Dot took a shining star and like I said he'll be uh, the next great Red Wing to wear the C uh, that's all I got in this episode of the Power Play with CJ on Detroit's next captain. Stay tuned for more episodes throughout the finals, the offseason, and beyond. Later, guys. And I apologize for the bad audio. Laptops, been screwing with me. Later, guys.